What's up guys, you're watching the door and today we got a new air gun. It's not mine, it's actually my dad's. I think I may have mentioned it in one of my videos. It's the Cross of Legacy 1000. It's a bad one. Uh, so, I broke this gun in for him so far. Uh, I've only, only had about maybe 50 pellets through it so far. So, and we're using the stock 4 x 15 scope that I came with so right at the moment. Uh, after shooting this thing sometimes, I kind of want to get myself one, but I want to get a break barrel for you guys. So, so pretty much bolt action. You gotta, you gotta put your pellet in this little hole right there. Uh, there's actually a BB uh, reservoir right here. Actually, it's not the reservoir. You actually have the the BB reservoirs at the bottom here. You have to pull it down the BBs to go in there. But I'll, I'll never use BBs out of any of my air guns. Oh, uh, what else here? Pumps just like this. And it's not too it's not too loud, but it has a white gold barrel, uh plastic to pot stock, uh, metal trigger. At the end the molar and a love millimeter dovetail rail. We're just using the scope because with it. But if I ever got myself one of these, which I might uh weed I'd actually upgrade it was I probably I probably put the little Daisy Power Line 49 by 32 scope on there, but whatever. This isn't mine, so it's not my problem. Uh, it is very accurate. Uh, it has it got it gets better grips than my Daisy Power Line 880. When I had that thing when it was good, when I used my when I originally got my Daisy Power Line 880, when I had the original scope on the 415 one. Uh, but the pellet that this one shoots very accurate with is the Gamma Red Fire. Uh, it shoots very accurate with that. I sliced this in. Uh, he actually bought some Daisy. Daisy. Uh, these are Gamma Red Fire. So I, think, I don't know what I said. Uh, he actually bought some Daisy hollow points for this gun, but th those pellets they shot, they shot. Yeah, so those pellets shot pretty well in this gun, but. Oh no, they shot better. Uh, this video, I stopped recording for some reason, but I, an ad popped up, so it stopped. Nice. So this is going to be all inconvenience there. A uh, little error. So, it's a great gun. Uh, very nice. So, I guess we'll take a shot out there, I guess, but it has a fiber off the front sight there. So, yep. So, this is a nice, it's a great gun. So, let's look at the pellet loaded in there. Take a shot outside. It's a little difficult to pump, but overall, not too bad. So uh, it says you can pump it up to 12 times to get the maximum power, but I'm only pumping this up to 10. So we're right, I think we're gonna put this milk jug out there, and we're just gonna take a shot off of it, so we can blow it off the back porch. So I'll pause you guys while I get this thing set up. And then we'll resume. So as you can see, there's the book curtain out there. We're going to shot that thing right now with this. And yeah, pretty much as soon as I pull the trigger, it's just going to blow off there. So Make sure you guys still see it. Right here we go. Well, 
Watch this blue shirt too. Blue shirt girl. Come back to pause the video. I'm wondering if we got my, my dad's Daisy Hollow Points. We'll take a shot with those at it. Hmm. I'm not expecting to do that. So, it hit the hole right where I was aiming. So, we'll get my dad's Daisy Hollow Points and. We'll Okay, so this gun has enough power that so the, the pedal just blows straight through the thing. Uh, if we don't hit it, this, if the mole car doesn't fly off there, we're just going to get my Daisy Powerline 35 and we're going to see if we can blow that thing off there. So, here we go, we're at some loaded. And, oh, this set of losing Daisy hollow points. So. Make sure y'all can still see it. Here we go. Hmm. Nice. Blue shirt for it. Plan B. Uh, I guess we're not going to take a shot with the uh, Daisy. Yeah, I think we'll do it. We'll try this thing in like five pumps since he feels still blow it over but I just won't go half. Six. Uh the blue blow actually that time it blew off. So Go put it back up there and uh, pause, pause the video and go put the thing back up there. So here we go. We're going to blow it right through the thing. Uh, if it doesn't, then we're, we're, this is we're actually going to get these third time. Yeah, blue streak. Let's do this thing. So, we'll put it back out there, I guess. And we'll get my Daisy 35. And yeah, Daisy 35 is going to knock it off. If the Daisy 35 doesn't knock it out there, then I guess we're just going to say screw it. So, here's the Daisy 35. We'll take a shot at it. No, don't fall off. Here we go. Hmm. Blue straight through it. Guess we're going to do five pumps. And this, this has to work, then we're going to push it off. And then we're going to use the game of fire here. So, here we go. Hmm. I guess we're not going to knock this thing off. One pop. Let's go. We'll do two. Finally, we'll do freaking one. I don't know how long I know it. Hmm, that's not enough air, I guess, for one pump. Let's put 
my gun broken? My gun may be broken. Okay, we just put a gamma red fire pellet in there backwards with five pumps. We got it jammed, but it'll come out. So we'll see if we can get this thing knocked over now. Okay, that's it. Okay, we're good. <laughs> So remember to like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching. I recommend either one of those guns. So see you next time on the, the outdoorsman.